So, here's what's happening. Asus, MSI, and Lenovo are all gearing up to drop new gaming laptops loaded with NVIDIA's unreleased GeForce RTX 5050. You can already spot these machines on sites like Newegg, the Asus store, and even a German retailer called Keeble. That's a pretty clear sign. The official RTX 5050 launch is just around the corner, even though NVIDIA is still tight-lipped. Now here's where things get a little messy. The VRAM. Earlier rumors said the RTX 5050 desktop card would use GDDR6 memory but now there's talk of GDDR7. For laptops, it's even more confusing. Some models are listed with GDDR6, others with GDDR7. Is this a typo or will there actually be two different memory types? Right now, no one really knows. Check this out. Asus Vietnam has already put up a page for their ROG Strix G16 with an RTX 5050. It packs 8GB of VRAM, but doesn't say which kind, paired with an Intel Core i7-14650HX 32GB of DDR5 RAM and a 1TB SSD. The price? A hilariously fake 999 million Vietnamese dong, clearly just a placeholder. Over in Germany, MSI's Helix 13 is up for grabs on Keeble. It's got a 16-inch screen, a beefy i9-13900HX, 16 gigs of RAM, and the RTX 5050. You can literally add it to your cart right now with deliveries listed in just a few days. Looks like some retailers are already shipping, embargo or not. And Lenovo's Legion 5i? That's showing up on Newegg for $2,228, claiming 8GB of GDDR7. Meanwhile, MSI says their 5050 has GDDR6. The memory mystery continues. Leaked specs suggest the RTX 5050 rocks 2,560 CUDA cores, 80 tensor cores, and 20 ray tracing cores running at up to 2,520 MHz, all according to previous leaks, so, seems legit. Bottom line, RTX 5050 gaming laptops are basically here, even if NVIDIA is still in stealth mode. The only real question left is about that VRAM, GDDR6, GDDR7, or both. We'll know soon enough. Subscribe for more GPU updates and I'll catch you in the next one.